Hey, how's it going guys? Captain Cube here, and today I'm gonna do something different. I'm going to correct one of my theory videos. This one to be exact. Distorted Solar System Theory. And yes, the thumbnail does say 18th century time traveler. This is by far one of my worst videos. The theory revolves around someone from the 1700s traveling back in time to give Tyr this mechanism. I know, this video is the worst, and if you wanna have a laugh, just click on this link. But anyways, I thought it was time to remake this theory, and come up with a better reason why this object is in Tyr's temple. So let's start from scratch. As you guys know, when you go inside Tyr's vault, you will see a number of artifacts belonging to other parts of the world. Among these items, you will come across this seemingly out of place object. Everything else you see in the room seems to have a ceremonial or religious purpose, but this one seems to be a machine. And as many people corrected me in my first video, this is not a solar system. This machine goes by the name of the Antikythera Mechanism. Part of this machine was discovered in 1901 near the Greek island of Antikythera. Archaeologists believe this machine was the first analog computer that was able to predict astrological positions. They also predicted this machine would look something like this if it was assembled completely, bearing a striking resemblance to the one seen in Tyr's vault. But is that all we know about the Antikythera mechanism in the God of War series? Actually no, what if I tell you that God of War Ascension tells us exactly who created this machine? Good old Archimedes. For those of you who don't know, in real life Archimedes was a famous mathematician, inventor and astronomer in ancient Greece. However, in the alternate universe of God of War, Archimedes was responsible for the construction of Apollo's statue found in the island of Delos. He is also responsible for the creation of the Antikythera mechanism. Once you fix Apollo's statue, just go to the right and you'll be able to pick up part of his machine. This one seems very similar to the one found in 1901. While the one seen in God of War 4 is completed, it's, it's possible that the one found in Ascension was his first model, while the one seen in Tyr's vault was his final work. But how did it get to Tyr's temple? Well, Mimir says that all the objects seen in Tyr's vault were brought by mortals who respected Tyr as a just god of war. Most likely, Archimedes himself traveled to Scandinavia and gave Tyr his greatest accomplishment, the Antikythera Mechanism. This journey must have taken place before the events of God of War Ascension, because sadly Archimedes went insane and eventually died as he finished Apollo's statue. If you're interested in more Tears Vault videos, I had recently uploaded one about the mysterious Medusa shield found in it, so if that sounds interesting to you, just click on this link. And I know this video is very short, I'm currently working on my Hermes Boots video, I expect that one to be longer. But anyways, I want to give a big thanks to all of my awesome members, people like Max Ford Gaming, Mr. Sir Mam, and Ski go the extra mile by supporting my channel monthly. If you would like to do the same, remember to click on the blue join button. I also want to thank all of my viewers and my loyal subscribers. With that said, thanks for watching, and remember, go forth in the name of the Antikythera Mechanism.